YouTube have made some changes to the way links are displayed and managed here on your YouTube profile page. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up links so that folks can click on your external links here in YouTube. Let's go. So previously, YouTube allowed you to add social media and other external links, and they were displayed right here on the header image on your profile page. However, now they're displayed here just underneath your logo and your description. So how do you get this set up and how do you make sure that your links are updated in this new location? Let's show you that now. Oh, before we get started, YouTube have also changed the way links work for shorts videos. So if you want to find out about that, check out the video linked up there or in the description. To add or update your links, first go to YouTube Studio by going to studio.youtube.com. On the left-hand menu, click on customization. At the top of the screen, click on basic info. Scroll down past your handle and description, which you can change while you're here if you like, and go to the links section. You'll see that I've got two links set up here already, one for my webpage and one for my gear guide. And you can check out both of those links in the description. So that you know what types of links you can and can't add to your YouTube channel, check out YouTube's external links policy. There's a link to it down in the description of this video. This will take you through all of the things you can and can't do with your links in your YouTube channel, but it's pretty straightforward. All the things that you're probably already aware of around YouTube's community guidelines, just stick to those. But links to your social media, your website, and even your affiliates links pages are usually A-OK. -okay. To add a new link here, we just click on the add link button and you'll need a title as well as the URL for your link. We're here in August, 2023. So Song Temba, our Song in a Month challenge is just around the corner. So I've decided to add a link directly to the Song Temba web page. If you've added a link that you no longer want displayed on your profile page, simply hit the trash can icon to remove it. Now you can add a lot of links here, I believe up to 14, but I recommend keeping it between three and five links because let's be honest, who's scrolling down to link number 12? Once you're ready to make changes, simply hit the publish button in the top right corner. And you'll see here your changes have been published. If you tap on the go to channel, it will take you into your channel so you can see where these are displayed. And there you can see your first link will be displayed in full there and folks can click that to go straight to your link. To access the other links, they'll need to click on this more links option, scroll down in your about section and check out the links down here. So you can see why it's super important to make sure your first link is the most important one. And for my mobile creator friends, unfortunately, this isn't available on the YouTube Studio mobile app right now. You'll need to go to a browser, go into desktop mode and then go to studio.youtube.com and make the changes just as we showed in this video. 